Hi, my name is Ta. Hello, I'm Mimena Papa. Hello, I'm Mimena Tamu. Today, we will be telling the story of Jonah. One day, there was a Hebrew man named Jonah. God appeared to him to tell him something. God told Jonah to go to Nineveh. And asked them to repent because they were very wicked people. But Jonah did not want to do this. He decided to go to Tarshish. He went down to Joppa and found the ship going to Tarshish. While the men on the boat were going on their journey, there was strong winds and harsh waves. Though all the men were afraid, but Jonah was sleeping. The shipmaster went and called Jonah and asked him to come and help them. After everything failed, they decided to cast lots. The lots fell on Jonah. They asked him, Who are you? What's your occupation? Where do you come from? Jonah answered, My name is Jonah. I am a Hebrew. My God is the God who created the land and the sea and all the earth. Later then, Jonah told them that he had ran away from God and that this was happening to punish him. The men tried to bring the boat back to land. But they could not. So they cried out to God that he should not let them all die just for this man. They asked Jonah what they should do. He said that they should throw him off the boat. They did not want to, but they did. Once they threw him in, the storm immediately calmed. But God prepared a big whale to come and swallow Jonah. Three days and three nights in the whale's belly. Jonah prayed and asked God to forgive him. God heard Jonah's prayers and asked the fish to spit him out. God told Jonah a second time to go to Nineveh. So Jonah went to Nineveh and preached unto the people there. He told them in simple words. In 40 days, Nineveh shall be overthrown. 
So when the people of Nineveh heard this, they believed God and repented. Meanwhile, Jonah went on top of a mountain and looked down on Nineveh, hoping that God would punish them. God provided a plant to give him shade because it was very hot. But then God also provided a caterpillar to eat the plant. Jonah didn't understand why God was not punishing Nineveh. So you not another Baba Manukola. You are the senior when you didn't wear that. But God told him that He wants all his children to repent. If we look at Second Peter three verse nine. It says, The Lord is not slacking concerning his promise, as some men may count slackness, but is long suffering to us, word, not willing that any should perish, but that all should come to repentance. The lesson that we learn here is it is not God's plan for us to perish. And wants us all to have salvation. The second lesson we learn is God has chosen each and every one of us for our own purpose. Like Jonah, even though he didn't want to preach to the Ninevites, but God's plan was for him to do it. So he had to do it. He couldn't escape from God. Thank you and may God bless you. Tak perlu ramai so esok ada ni dek.